the Gadget God here. And today I'm gonna to show you how to live record your video screen on both iPad and iPhone using no external hardware using iOS 11. So the first thing that you'll need to do on both devices, go into your settings and then go to control center. Once you've gone to control center, go to customize controls. And the main thing that you need to do is add screen recording. We've added it on the iPad. We have added it on the iPhone. Now we can go back out of the control center. We will go back to the home screen. And now I will show you how to actually live record your video screen. So all you need to do to record anything that you're doing on your screen is swipe up to get the control center. And that circle icon will live record your screen. So we will go ahead and hit it on the iPad and hit it on the iPhone. Now I'll just close these out, go back to the home screen. And that red bar lets you know that you were actually recording your screen. So if I go into the photo app, for example, I could be showing something, I could be doing a demo or gameplay on my screen, and it is actually recording it directly on the iOS hardware. So once you are done, you can go ahead and tap that red bar, and it will ask you, do you wanna stop recording? We'll just say stop on both. And it lets you know your recording has just been saved to your photos. So let's go ahead and see that Let's say I'm here on my iPad, for example, I will go to my Photos app, and there it is, down at the very bottom, my screen recording. And it will actually record your audio as well. So we can see there's my screen recording, it's showing whatever I did on my iPad or my iPhone, just like it was a video. Now let's say I wanted to edit this video that I just recorded and get rid of the beginning and the end. With my video showing here, I can tap edit. And now I can use these tabs on either end of the video to shorten the beginning of my video. I want to start here. And then the end of my video, I want it to end without that stop screen recording part. So there we go. Now I will say done. I'll save it as a brand new clip. And now we can see I just saved my video with the trimmed edges so it doesn't show those parts of where I started recording and ended recording. So that is how you can record your screen directly on your iPad or your iPhone using Apple's iOS 11 software. Let me know if you have any questions or comments down below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Click subscribe to join the Gadget God squad. And if you didn't know already, I'm the Gadget God. I do the research so you don't have to. Thanks for watching everybody and record your screen today.